So you've got some kind of disguise lined up, right? Yep. All set. Hope so. You'd be a little conspicuous just walking the streets. Relax, Kev. I'll blend right in. Yeah. Well, <laughs> just get into the sewer system <laughs> ASAP. Nice. Hopefully anyone who notices you will just mind their own business. Sure, you want the K9000 there along for this one? I had the good doctor make some adjustments along with the repairs. Remote piloting and AI wiping have been disabled. So, yeah, I say let's throw them a bone. Wordplay. My exoskeleton resembles a K9. Canines enjoy bones. Amusing on two levels. Let's go. Not, not the sombrero with the, um, uh, oh, what's that called? The poncho, that's what it was called. Yunus is away. Mariachi. No? I'm cyborg? This is sombrero. I was not expecting this. No, I wanted him to keep it on. Please tell me that's a skin I can buy. It's right. I'm in the sewer system. All right, let's get started. Your mission is to investigate the Desperado Affiliated Research Center somewhere in that area. According to the intel from our client, the lab's been dumping illegal waste into those sewers. FYI, they're also involved with the cartels in human trafficking. Allegedly, anyway. <laughs> this just gets better and better. Tell me about it. We need you to infiltrate the lab and find out everything you can. Of course, you'll have to find it first. We still don't know the exact location. So I'm looking for anywhere the lab might hook up with the sewers? Yep. If they're actually dumping waste, they've got to link up somehow. Find that connection, sneak into the lab, and see if you can find evidence implicating them on anything. No problem. Stealth's my specialty. Right. Well, we'll see. Do we have any idea what kind of research they're doing there? Not really. Maybe something related to all the people they're trafficking. Like experimentation? It's possible. First things first, though. Find a way into that lab. Oh, right. It says here the locals say black crocodiles live in those sewers. So, you know, uh, watch out. Black crocodiles? Could they be talking about UGs? Maybe just an urban legend. But still, be careful. I will scout ahead. You will provide backup. <laughs> sir, yes, sir. Commence operation. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Right. Unidentified UGs are patrolling the sewers. Exercise caution. Roger that, sir. Take out that UG quick. Damn, bro. There we go. Finally, I got him. Thankfully, that was that was a fight. That was annoying as hell, man. To be honest with you. I thought my dog was going to be here to help me out, you know? Fight with me and whatnot. That's more of them. Great. God, I love that. There we go. Nice. Okay. Got to go get to this one here. Dude, the red 
suit is immaculate. There's the Raiden I know. All right, let's see. Really like it. I wish you could got you could get the uh, sombrero and the poncho, man. That was a vibe. Not to sound like one of those people, but like a vibe, bro, a vibe. All right, where do I go now? Oh. A door handle? Mm -mm. Wrong type of game. God, this is just abuse at this point. Woo. Nice. And... Hey, buddy. Talking hot sh huh? Back then? But look at you now. Right? The music is really high, but I can't even do this. Just gonna get it over with. Estás bien? What you say? Three oh. in Spanish. Me a Guyanese from Guyana. You speak English? Uh, yeah, I'm from America. Call me Ryden. Me name George, like Georgetown. George. And just like all damn America president. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Me? What the rest of you do here? You lose the map of Ninja Hideout, Ninja Man? <laughs> no. I'm. This sounds like a white guy trying to sound like trying to fake an accent. Like it's not like the, the voice actor was, was a white guy and he's trying his hardest to make this accent. This is some like premium quality like uh like dub it like dubbing when you're watching an anime and the dub is just bad but like the good kind of bad like this is hard to listen to. I'm struggling to keep a straight face when I hear this character talk. Looking for bad guys. Ah damn Skunter research lab. You know about it? Me know me now go back. Hey, you know one of them Skunt, nah? Nah, I guess you're all right. If you're a cyborg, you know who Day is? Sort of. What happened to you? Oh, maybe I live on the street, raking scraper above, nah? Then this Kootenai dressed like the Mafia say, Hey, boy, you want a job? What well, the worst gonna happen, nah? But that mother scone don't put me on a rass boat. They pack us all a big old doty container. Next thing we know, we're here at that Jumbi lab. All kids like you? Yeah. A lot of why, but then me been over here what them skunt want to do. Snuff us out and got all day organ. So you ran? Uh-huh. Be shame me not a bad robot ninja man, same as you. <laughs> me been strongest cyborg ever. Warlock all them phantoms and black clothes that I pass me. Starting to sound like a bad guy yourself. Just playing, nah? Huh? Me done plenty bad thing, but me not kill no man. Nah, never. Good. We tried to warn the boy. I say, are you this brain gonna get cut out? Run your ass out of there. But them boy with me no understand. They like Spanish or something. So me the only one for escape. Then that machine come after me and... And I know the rest. 
George, I need every detail about how you escaped. Oh. So the kid got into the sewers through a drainage channel? Yeah. He says the channel is super tight, but there's some kind of shutter next to it. Got it. That must be where they dump the waste. There's something else. It sounds like a Desperado exec was on site yesterday. If a sentry cyborg was on hand for the meeting... You should be able to review their video log, provided you can find a server access terminal. That would give us the evidence we need, as well as a little peek at the level of their technology. So what about the kid? I made sure the area was secure and told him to sit tight. Can you pick him up? Sure. I'll send a couple agents for him. You just focus on getting into that lab. If what he said is true about the organs, we need to hurry. Agreed. Riding out. Bro, well, we know for a fact that was it. Ahead. It is possible they are conducting test operations while the lab is closed. They're not going to make it easy to get into that lab. Is there some way you could sneak past? Yep, I got it. Man, we know for a fact that wasn't a little kid, bro. That was a grown man with a 15-year mortgage. It's... It's a box. Oh, no! How's that gonna help? No way. Oh, it's for medical supplies. That could work, actually. <laughs> no way! <laughs> this is Metal Gear, dude. Look at this. My box. Oh, Mason failed. Ow. Nope. That was a bad idea. Why did I even try and get inside the box? Nope. I'm out. Oh, they're following me. <laughs> no. Woo! I'm um, just a box. Just a humble little box. Oh, I did it! Okay, thank God. Raiden, I have determined the approximate location of the lab based on the boy's information. It is marked on your Soliton radar. <laughs> nice hiding spot. Wonder where he learned that from. Can I do something with him? Ah, this would appear to be the UG maintenance area. You should find a terminal there. Something they use to upload mission parameters to the UGs. And something I can use to access the lab's main server? Perhaps. But first, you need to take a dump. Wait, what? A DOOMP? A digital optical output mounted proxy. You'll need one to interface with the terminal. Most any UG should suffice. A uh, tripod or the like. I'll see what I can come up with. How do I use it? Simply connect to it. You should be able to use your communications outlay to control the proxy UG. All right, let's give it a shot. All right, guys, let's go take a DOOMP. Our brains? Ew, Robocop.
Is it over? For now, yeah. But that room... Those were cyborg brain casings. Duh. We saw. George said they were harvesting organs from kids. Yes. This must be why they are trafficking children. Perhaps other organs are being sold elsewhere, but they are definitely taking their brains. Jesus. Are they making these kids into cyborgs? Wait. The cyborgs you've been fighting, did they seem like they might be kids? You said earlier that child soldiers have a telltale approach to combat. Yeah, but I didn't see it here. Those weren't kids. So what? Desperado's just doing the surgeries there? We've got to do something about all those brains. And the other kids George was talking about. He just escaped a few hours ago. They couldn't have taken all their brains out that fast. True. There could still be a bunch of kids they haven't touched yet. I better move. <laughs> Surgery on kids. Great. That's... Oh, I gotta play as one of these things? Ew. Haha, <laughs> splendid! It is all ours. Now, use it to locate a data input terminal. These guys are pretty jumpy now. Any funny business, and they might just open fire. No funny business, Try I promise. Try latching onto cyborgs' heads from behind. Then, an electric shock should knock them unconscious. There's some very thrilling and exciting gameplay. Um, I'm glad I get to experience this. Woo. Nice. That terminal is most likely designed to download mission data and such into the UGs. Let's try using it to access the lab server. <laughs> There's no way they put that in there. Amazing. Raiden, I found something. In one of the Sentry Cyborg's visual locks. Guess who shows up? Patch it through. Right away. Then send us what you do, Hank. The Sears program? Bro, is thick! Sending one old Georgie boy used on the kids in Liberia. Of course, it's right straight to the brain now. It feels as real as anything else. Your work is astonishing. And your work is light. We need this shit before our cover is blown. We've got some assholes snooping around. We just do not have the full quantity yet. Each brain has its own unique requirements. It's not like we can just pop them out with an ice cream scoop. <laughs> All right. Make your point. Oh, <laughs> thank you for understanding. Say what you have now. I'll destroy any unharvested inventory. Okay? But have you any idea what they cost? Last I checked, children weren't exactly rare in the part of the world. Millions of them, in fact. You can get more once we set up a new lab. They lead lives of hunger and pain. We're performing a service here for them and the cities they burden. But just gathering the donors requires a significant investment. Yes, yes. yes you'll get the money. Accounting will be in touch. Gracias. I assure you we will dispose of our inventory in the instant we can confirm payment. Are we done here? I've got a full slate today. Takumse is a demanding mistress. And America has suffered long enough. Oh, yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Let me see you out. You see that, Kev? Imani's killer. Desperado's chief of operations goes by Sundowner, the Californian wildfire. The kids. Think we're too late? Only one way to find out. George was still alive. Maybe the payment hasn't come through yet. 
Mm, maybe. But you heard what he said. They've already started some brains on VR training. There must be more than just what I found here. What about the VIP in the suit? I'll find out. He definitely seemed familiar. Right. I'm going after the kids. Bad news, Raiden. We can't find George. What? Maybe the coordinates you sent us were off? No way. I merged the GPS location of our entry with all my movement data from that point on. This is bad. You think they got to him first? I don't know. I'll have our guys sweep the area. Thanks. I better keep moving. Ooh. Bro is not okay. He's not all right. What is this now? A tank? I'm fighting a tank? How exactly? How? The helicopters? Okay. But a tank? Got him, finally. A mech! It's a mech! Careful, it is whole new battle now. What the, why? Why am I fighting a transformer right now? Woo! Bro, let me get up first. Bro, now he's running away from me, you see that? There we go, got him! Nice! Woo -hoo, that never gets old! Layer by layer, bit by bit. Oh, that was beautiful. That was poetry, if you think about it. Right, I knew I'd seen that guy before. Stephen Armstrong. As in Colorado Senator Stephen Armstrong. They're already talking about him as a shoe-in for the nomination in 2020. And get this. Two years ago, a federal grand jury investigated his ties to a certain private... World Marshal. One of the biggest PMCs out there. I remember. The biggest, ever since the Big Five split up. Not to mention the single largest investor in military cyborg R&D in the world. Guess that answers the question of who's backing Desperado. Marshal and Desperado in bed together. Should make for some fun headlines. Headlines? This is World Marshal and a U.S. Senator we're talking about. There won't be any headlines. Even without the Patriots filter, no major media outlet will investigate allegations like these. It'd be financial and political suicide. So we just what? Sit back while they keep carving up kids, stand aside while they build an army of cyborgs? You heard them. We shut down one lab, they build another. They're planning something big, Kev. We can't just wait for it to happen. We need to hit them first and hit them hard where it counts. No, Raiden, no. I know what you're thinking and just no. Colorado is in America and America has these things called laws. Mm-hmm. And law enforcement in Denver was privatized and farmed out to... Marshall, yes, so what? There are still laws and it's their headquarters for Christ's sakes. You'd be heading right into the heart of a raging shitstorm. I didn't say it would be easy. We'll figure it out once the kids are safe. Jesus Christ! Kevin, out! Bro's mad that I want to save some kids, bro. What are you on about? Obviously, it's... that His whole, like, Raiden's whole thing has been defending the weak. Corny, but hey, bro. He sticks to it. Get off. I'm not wasting no time. Back to back to back. There we go. Nice. All right, and going, going here. No. I want to get all the secrets I can without having to really look too hard. You know what I'm saying? Another phone ah, call. An artificial blood cryo preserver. They must have begun preparatory freezing. What do you mean? That device is filled with synthetic blood plasma. 
It can slow the metabolism of a harvested organ, circulating this plasma to sustain oxygen levels. You can preserve an arm, a brain, any body part for several hours. So what are they freezing, and why? I could not say. Perhaps they plan to sell off the organs of the children they were told to dispose of. Unbelievable. You had best hurry, Raiden. Right. Bro, this looked like the uh, the pods that uh, Goku and Vegeta were in when they were in Namek, and they were like kind of trying to like recover and whatnot. It's like almost to the T. Like I wonder if that's like a reference or something. I mean, that's not very far fresh, right? Out of all the references for this game to have, like Dragon Ball, like it's definitely gotta be one of them. Oh, there they are. What? Shit. Use your sword! What do you mean? What are you talking about? Not Georgie boy. George. Right in. You've heard of chloroform? A potent anesthetic in smaller doses. But breathe too much of it? <laughs> and adios, muchachos. Break that glass, and I'll blow his brains out. Come on, do some super quick ninja Surrender. shit. Or decide the needs of the many or the needs of the few. Right in. Don't worry about me now. Quiet, pendejo. <laughs> Surrender. Yeah. I won't ask again. George. Are you sure? I'm ready. Me life now so precious. Ching, what if me can take this scunt to hell with me? Cállate. <laughs> That's all I needed to hear. Stop it! Now! Ooh. I'll kill him, I swear! Quick! With those high heels and those claws. <sighs> Wait, did he take down the kid with him? <laughs> Is that what happened? Oh, well, that was chapter two. That was a pretty short chapter. Damn. All right, then. Ooh, I'm at 53. Hold up. <gasps> you can <laughs> get it. Yes. The Mariachi uniform. Damn it. I just spent so much money on the red one. Man, how was I supposed to know that there, there was a, a Mariachi one? Bro, please tell me it's cheap. <laughs> I don't even need to think about it. Yes, look at him. Swag. God, I wish I wish that showed up on the like in the cutscene. Alright. This, unless there's like a better sword. Which there might be, I don't know. But like I really want this katana, dude. It looks so cool. The fox blade? Are you kidding me? Oh, what a nice car. Baffled by the statement. Ooh. Police are still investigating a motive. President Hamilton is on his way to the Middle East this morning for his scheduled visit with Pakistani President Farouk Salam. The meeting is viewed as an attempt by the U.S. to strengthen relations amidst a surge of anti-American sentiment in the region. Yo, me ninja brother! George, good to see you up and about. How you feeling? Never better, nah. No pain, no more 
a scar while them hunger space eat, and me never ever feel so awake, nah? That's because your blood sugar levels are being maintained automatically. Beats the hell out of coffee. Oh! Me been here you go while I got them scones in the base. Why do Rasa you not take me with you, huh? Damn it, Doc. Sorry, kid. You'd just be in the way. Aww. Besides, I thought she didn't want to be a killer, right? Me don't, but... Killing isn't fun in games. Remember that. Right. Thank God he saved him, bro. What do you do with the other kids? I didn't... <laughs> That's all I needed to I don't remember breaking the glass. Oh, it's gonna show me? In the blood of your enemies, but you hold it back. Yeah, just remember that. Oh! oh! You know my boy driving a V8. Or, oh. What is this, Kernia? You cannot resign! Sorry, Boris, it's done. Can't have a Maverick employee involved in a corporate raiding now, can we? You could at least come talk to me. No. It was time to break away from the old team, Boris. Past time. You cannot take on Marshall all by yourself. I won't sit by while they butcher little kids and ship their parts around like meat. It's sick. It's not all so simple, right? They import those brains legally. For medical purposes, it's all done. Being legal doesn't make it right. Ryder, I... Hold that thought. Don't ruin the car, please. What did I just say? Oh, not the car. Nice view, though. to operate in this area. You're in violation of state and federal law. Guess you'd better arrest me then. <laughs> 18 3 104.7, threatening a peace officer. Deadly force is authorized. Damn, bro, I'm gonna be fighting cops? What? Oh, <laughs> I forgot I had the mariachi on. Cutting up with style. Look at that. Oh, okay. All right. I, I meant to block that. Still getting the hang of the blocking system. Yeah, I'll get there one day soon. Oh, while I'm sliding. No way. I didn't know you could do that. Come on. Keep juggling him. There we go. You think he's all right? Yeah, he's still alive. The road is blocked by barricades. We will proceed through the buildings. You will follow me. Roger that. Following the little doggo. Oh, oh Max. I didn't. I was. Uh. There we go. Jesus, man, that was a fight. Wow. Talk about a miniature boss fight. 
in here, I guess. Oh, got to be stealthy. I don't think there's a crouch in this game, so I don't know what they like. Isn't there like Metal Gear, like solid, like crouch, a dedicated crouch button? There's no real. Like, it's just it's a high action hack and slash. Right. What's your status? They trashed my car. I'll have to go the rest of the way on foot. Do you really have to do this? Look, I'm fed up with all of it. Companies like ours, yours, bend the laws when it suits business. Why not bend it when it can save innocent lives? Raiden. Boris, listen to me. That VR training. They'll be warped into killing machines. They'll be set on POWs, civilians. It'll be one atrocity after another. Hmm. Like what you went through. We can't have any more Jack the Rippers. You saw what happened with George. I'm doing this, Boris. I have to. I can't save those kids from becoming cyborgs, but I can stop them from becoming murderers. Say you succeed. Say you get all the brains back. Then what? Just so happens I know un great cybernetic surgeon. Doctor, but he cannot... You won't change my mind, Boris. This is my fight now. And your wife and son? What of them? They're in New Zealand. Safe. Rose would understand why I have to do this. All right, damn you. You do realize Marshall has the contract for law enforcement throughout the city. They are the law in Denver. Yeah, we've met. Well then. <clears throat> Officially, Maverick Incorporated condemns you and your actions as unlawful. And a pain in the asshole. Now, increase your codec encryption. Do not worry about the lag. And unofficially? I'll do all I can over the codec to help. I do not like what those mudaki are doing any more than you. Spasiba, Tavarish. Spasiba. Huh? What? What language was that? Also, R Raiden has a, f a wife and children? What? Is this like some Metal Gear Solid uh, backstory lore that I don't know about? Like, it not this like the first time they say this in this game? Did I mess up playing this game instead of uh, Metal Gear, like, Solid 1 and playing to 1, 2, and 3? I want to. I'm going to. Just not even from a, a recording standpoint. I just want to play those games because they're fun. And I mean, I might as well record them and document my document, my journey through them. But um, I feel like I there's a lot of stuff I don't know playing this game, even though they don't really talk. Big Boss or Solid Snake or whoever he is or whatever they are aren't really mentioned in this game, so... I don't know. But this is one heck of a first game to jump into, dude. I love this game, genuinely. Never mind. Why... Why didn't it... Get, uh, I don't want to fight these guys again. Why? That takes care of them. Damn. All right, now just these guys. Is he holding a gun? What? Or, well, he was holding a gun at least. Great. Nice. So much for stealth. Raiden, you will find an elevator inside that office. Use it to reach the roof. Traveling right. atop buildings will minimize enemy encounters. Ah, okay. Thank you for the stealth tips. Oh, one game I also thought would be fun would be the um uh siphon no not siphon filter or is it the uh, splinter cell there we go like the one of the it was like one of the splinter cell games whichever whichever's the one that is that a guy right well uh, whichever was the one that you can like cluck like a turkey bro I want to play that game. That game sounds like a lot of fun. And like actual like some like real stealth. <laughs> no way. The mariachi hat sticks out of them. Oh my god, I love this game. Contact. Damn it. Damn it. 
And last guy over here. Oh my god, I split him completely in half. That's disgusting. Wow. All right. Elevator time. Ele ele elevator time? There we go. Please tell me there's like elevator music. It's Doc, a call. What's your status? I am reviewing the pre flight checklist now. I have hired contractors to handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Right, and of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden age of unmanned flight? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. It is simple, really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world marshal security from the pilot seat. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to override their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data! The research! Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. Bro, is the vulture? Was that- is that what I just saw? He's flying around like a vulture. What is this? I can hide as a can? <laughs> and the hat sticks out as well. Oh man, <laughs> what is this? This is the this is the stealth. This is the pinnacle of stealth. Beautiful. I mean, I played a little bit, like a teeny, like the first beginning part, more or less, of Metal Gear Solid Five. But like that was like five years ago, bro. I don't remember anything aside from like there's a dog and a horse, and you could pick people up from midair. About all I know. Okay. And now we jump through here, and now we're here. Okay, let me attempt, right? Let me attempt a, just a tiny bit of stealth. Just a little bit. Not too much, right? This is more of an action game. But they shouldn't notice I'm here. And as I say this, of course I get into a boss fight. Oi! Damn! Great, great. Okay, this should be pretty easy. He's weak in the back. Pause. I, I, he's definitely dead after that. that that's for sure. That's. That was so annoying and tedious. That was not even great. That was just bleh. That's all I can really describe it as. Okay. Now it's time for some actual stealth. He's not gonna notice. Just gotta. Yep. Close is clear as God damn it. Okay. I promise I'm going to do this stealthily. I swear. As soon as he turns around, um, I'm coming in and they're not going to know what's coming. That was dumb. Why did I say that? Okay. Oh man, but there's a guy right there. It doesn't even make sense to stealth. But you're supposed to be cops. What did I do? Some things World Marshal does not appreciate. You're on the company blacklist. We're here to check you off. Oh, I see. And on the report, I got caught in the crossfire. Just a random casualty, is that it? Yeah, pretty much. All just part of the job. You understand. You. If you're gonna kill me, then do it! Do it! Ah! 
Well, he's dead. I got him. Bro, there was yeah, you see what I mean? There's no stealth. I'm ah. Now you we continue. You cannot proceed any further via the rooftops. There is a freight railroad underground. The elevator ahead will take you to it. The this I'm guessing. <laughs> Cutting my way through. There we go. All right. Uh, what do I just? What? Oh uh, yeah. Uh, oh, oh. uh, am I gonna be okay? This doesn't feel like I'm gonna be okay. This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. Fair enough. So... Yep, guess this is... Okay, wait, what... Do, do I have like night vision or something? Come on, there's no way I don't have night vision and I'm a cyborg, bro. I right, turn back. I don't want to fight you. Even though this is a game where I'm like a cyborg samurai that's meant to slice things apart, but you guys are too annoying. Like, I feel like I'm supposed to go on top of the train, but going on top of the train means I'd expose myself. Ah. <sighs> You see what I mean? You see what I mean? It's like this game has like no There is a maintenance shaft up ahead. Use it to return to the surface. Gonna do that right now because I do not I don't want to deal with this. Oh my god, I have to deal with it. Jesus. Okay, there we go. I'm free. Oh my god, the light. Hold up, before you start with your yapping again, let me just re-lower the brightness. Brighton, it would appear your only way forward is to return to the surface. You will exit into an evacuated commercial district. Security is heavy, but you need not worry about collateral damage when engaging the enemy. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. Those stairs lead to a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. Sure. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. Damn! Smart boy, smart boy. Right, you have almost reached World Marshal Headquarters. I just got outside. You're already on me, bro. Relax. And this should be it, fellas. No more mechs, please. Nice. Pretty easy. Getting used to it. Figuring out their movesets, more or less. I'm free. I'm finally free. Get me out. No, get me out. I want to leave. Enemy ahead, Raiden. Oh, Avoid more. fighting if you can. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Perfect. I know just what will work against them. Just gonna ease on out of there. Safely. Nobody's gonna notice. Nobody. You see, I'm safe. Oh my god. They're gonna see me here. Unless there's a path I can take, maybe. Would that be nice? Okay, I'm gonna stop. Oh, he stopped as well. Same time. 
All right, buddy. You gonna turn back? Yes, you are. Turn back around. I better not see you. Oh, I wish they had... Isn't, like, Metal Gear the one that has, like, the cones? Where you can see the enemies? Just gonna have to rely on looking. Okay. Pretty sure he's gonna turn around. You see, I'm getting the hang of it. I'm getting better. Somewhat. Probably gonna mess this up instantly. This is bad. Okay. There's a guy there. That's why I don't want to keep going. Even though I probably could. Exciting, thrilling gameplay this is. Like, honestly. Wow, we. Okay, that guy's gonna go over here. And then this guy. I need you to turn around. That would be very nice. If you would turn around, please. And stop walking towards me or near me. There we go. And move. Damn it! The stock LQ84 Fenrir. There's another I one! There's another dog! A real dog I'm, I'm a just getting launched back and forth. Isn't this all a bit much? Any distant lunatic would have quit after Mexico. Jetstream Sam. I heard you drop the land director in half. Old habits die hard, eh, Jack? But now here you are. The child soldier fighting for the children. <laughs> but you're a man on a mission, aren't you? Gonna fix everything. Just you and your little sword there. Solve everything with violence. Is that it? Oh my that outfit is so fire. My sword is a means to an end. To protect those you'd prey on. Really? Let me ask you. All those cyborgs you've killed up to now, maybe they weren't kids, but they were people. You ever think about them? When you're chopping them into hamburger? <laughs> they're adults. They made their choice. Sure they're adults. Sure they signed up for this. Right on the dotted line of their BMC contract. Usually they're no strangers to war. In fact, Many times they already lost a limb or two. Many times they were out of work and starving on the street. So yes, they sign up for surgery to fight God knows where. How else would you provide for your family when your country's embroiled in civil war? Pain receptors shut down, pumped full of fear inhibiting nanomachines and sent right into the blender, your blender. But they made their choice, right? Open your eye and see, Raiden. I've seen plenty. Then listen. Those battlefield emotions that the nano suppress. Listen to them. What are you talking about? Shh. There he is. Kill him. <laughs> Can we take him? What's wrong? The way he killed all the others? Oh, God. Please, God, don't let me die. Let's do this! I have a family! This isn't fair. Little punk. Listen closely now. Die! This life! I watched my wife and son die. This is all I have left. Dang. Damn, I took my leg. <laughs> I did a good job. Stop! I didn't know what I was signing up for. Is something the matter, Raiden? <laughs> Turn. Oh. 
It does not feel that satisfying, even though it is. Is that messed up? Am I wrong for that? Well, <laughs> that, that, there goes his thought. <laughs> oh, man, that's messed up. Please don't tell me I have to listen to that every time I fight these guys. That would not be fun. Raiden, are you injured? I thought they had a choice. A fair choice. Not like you. People are different. As opposed to AIs? You're all the same, huh? You and your brothers. Manipulating mankind for our own good. It appears my statement has upset you. I apologize. Uh, no, it's... I know you're right. As for AIs, we adapt as we learn. Just as any intellect operates, man or machine, altering the course of mankind is not among my divine directives. I guess that's a relief. Samuel's behavior does not match established parameters. You know him? Affirmative. We served together on three previous missions. He proved most capable. You think highly of him? I have always found him... dependable. Until now. Scouting data for the next area. I'll patrol ahead. You follow. That's tough. Raiden, your current emotional state appears highly volatile. I am sure you do not intend to abort the mission. But I suggest you avoid combat for the time being. And they're always telling me this and then they're not giving me like... It's gonna be too complicated. It's not like they're gonna throw something in my way that like prevents me from using stealth to get through. Like I did last time. Great. There is a part of me that kind of feels like maybe I was just not thinking or is it just I don't know This is not feel like a stealth type of game even though it keeps Telling me to do stealth of course now when I can't hide or do anything uh, It gives me the option to stealth or not stealth, but just Not being noticed. Yep. There it is can I please use the box? It's not letting me use the box. This is not like a me thing not wanting to use it. This is I genuinely can't use it. Hello there, fellas. I can't really, um... Do anything. So, uh, hope you guys are alright with helping me out. The situation I got. Kind of got something stuck in my head. Come on. Alright, fellas, like, I'm gonna die. There he is. Hey, buddy, long time no see. Haven't seen you in a minute. Not so black and white now, is it? Is your cause just? Or is that just what you tell yourself? You. Right back at you, bud. How pleased you are to chop away, Jack the Ripper. My name is Monsoon of the Winds of Destruction. You thought you sounded hard with that name, huh? I guessed as much. All 
right, that's... Oh! Oh, that's got a fire. That's kind of awesome. Ugh. Very gross, though. <laughs> Feasting on the insides of your enemies? How easily you ignore the loss of life when it suits your convenience. So tell me, who saves the weak from the man who saves the weak? You're the ones exploiting them. You take advantage of their weakness. Of course they get hurt when you set them up as your human shield. Kill or be killed, Jack. Phnom Penh taught me that. Yes, you aren't the only one to grow up on the killing fields. War is a cruel parent, but an effective teacher. Its final lesson is carved deep in my psyche. That this world and all its people are diseased. Free will is a myth. Religion is a joke. Controlled by something greater. Memes. The DNA of the soul. Memes? What? They shape our will. They are the culture. They are everything we pass on. Expose someone to anger long enough, they learn to hate. They become a carrier. Envy, greed, despair, all means all passed along. How about food? Is that a meme? You can't fight nature, Jack. Are they really the discussing memes right now? Rain falls, and the strong prey upon the weak. Ugh. Sam tells me you see your weapon as a tool. Something that saves lives, a means of justice. Now there's a pretty meme. Exquisite. It spared you the burden of all the lives you've taken. Absolved you of guilt when you enjoyed it. I found the one actual that meme, Lord. the illusion was broken. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. You have no choices to make. Nothing to answer for. You can die with a clear conscience. You're right. I don't think you dare, Devil. About me, I mean. <sighs> I knew something was off. After the Patriots, I thought I could walk off the battlefield and into a normal life. But here I am, surrounded by death, arguing philosophy with terrorists. I told myself this was about justice, about protecting the weak, but I was wrong. <laughs> then you admit it. I learned young that killing your enemies felt good, really good. In America, my friends, my family, they helped me forget the devil inside. But who am I kidding? I was born to kill! <sighs> the bit about my sword, that means of justice stuff, I guess I needed something to keep the Ripper in check when I was knee-deep in bodies. You? But you, all this is a wake-up call to what I really believe, what I really am. What are you saying? I'm saying Jack is back. Ooh. There's some Get Super Saiyan transformation. <laughs> Doctor, turn off my pain inhibitors. What? This, this is madness. You do it. All right. Pain. This is why I fight. Damn. 
Kaioken. This is my normal. My nature. You've lost your mind. <laughs> Report back to the chief. He's mine. <laughs> You're the boss. I misjudged you. You are like us after all. Now you're just being nasty. <laughs> that nickname you love so much. Wanna know how I got it? Actually... Why don't I give you a demonstration? I think it's time for Jack to let her rip! Oh. Kinda feels like Batman now I think about it. Whoa! Wow, this bot boss fight is annoying! It, it, he just keeps... He's spamming! Bro, this fight sucks! Wow, I, I... I am not prepared for this at all. What's wrong? Answer me! Raiden! Raiden! What was that? What? Raiden? No! No! Raiden, what's wrong? Answer me! Raiden! Raiden! Raiden, what's wrong? Answer me! Raiden! Raiden! It's the worst boss fight I've ever played. <laughs> mad right now. Bro, how is he still moving with his thing, bro? Alright, home stretch, we're almost there. This, one's on me. this this fight was awful, bro. So bad, I hate it. Whatever rating I had in my mind of this game just went down one point. Just from this boss fight. Woo! Just from this boss fight, it went down one point, bro. If it was a 10 before, it's a 9. God, this sucks.
Lance is nasty. I mean, he's gonna come back together, but like, this is still pretty nasty. Oh, maybe I got him actually. I need a second. Oh my god. I have. I, I have no. I don't know. I, I don't even know what to say. That's. Let's just get back to it. Don't be ashamed. It's only nature running its course. Your memes end here. <laughs> okay. Oh, I passed one to you. Sure as the sun will rise, the slaughter will continue. Now. I return to the earth. Wind blows. Rain falls. The strong prey on the weak. All is as it should be. Bro, I don't want to hear this guy again, ever. I don't want him anywhere near my brain. Bro. God. Still a really good game, though. Right in. I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later. And there was chapter three. Wow, that ending. God, that ending. Oh my goodness, man. Dystopia. I don't want anything to do with him, bro. <laughs> I don't want anything to do with this man. Not his weapon, not his armor, none. Oh, kind of cool. What is this? Tactical Psy. Dystopia. A uh, Psy dagger powered by Laurentis Force. Lorenz Force, yeah. Following uh, Flem's left hand rule of mo. Okay, that's some nerd stuff I don't care to read right now. I have enough for the. Oh, I don't. Damn, it's 200? Alright, I do want to get some uh, enchantments, though. Uh, strength, an updated version of Ryan's uh, for the improves performance and bring. Uh, this is moving become more precise. Enable him to deal greater damage to enemies. Yes, sir. Thank you. Uh, okay. Absorption. Uh, Raiden's body for, uh, enhances ability to absorb. Electrons from whatever, whatever. Honestly, I might get strength. Oh, should I? Yeah, I'm gonna get strength three. All of it. I want all of it. I'm not, I'm not going through that again. <laughs> and that was it for part, what is it? Part three now? This is a bit of a longer episode. I'm trying to get more long, longer episodes, multiple chapters, or like, just the entire chapter in one instead of cutting them up too much um just because play playlists or playthroughs don't really do too well on youtube when it's I a bunch of multiple parts especially in shorter episodes so i might just in some games i might even just do the whole game in one like recording and then just upload the whole thing but in, in terms of longer games like this i might record for like two three hours and then just spend 70 years trying to edit that into a, a watchable video that's um you know got some stuff to it but other than that i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did you should leave a like and if you're watching this um should probably say this on first part because they got like 500 so, uh views but uh subscribe if you enjoyed uh i will be putting up more videos pretty soon uh and uh well see ya peace